Hello guys welcome to Vision Lads. This is our fifth class of Photoshop for beginners. So let's start our today's class. So let's talk about Crop Tool. You can select from here. Or you can press C for shortcut. Now you can see this grid. Now you can select any side of this grid. And drag it like this. Simply hit enter to crop the image. Now if you check this option here, and now you crop your image. This will delete your image or its pixels. But when you uncheck this, now it will keep your image and won't delete any pixels. You can also drag and select anywhere to crop that particular area. From here you can change your grids. Now if you increase the size of its grid, you will see it won't add any extra pixels. It will remain empty. So for this, check this content aware, and now increase its size. And you will see, it will fill that area. Now moving on, right click on it, select perspective crop tool, simply drag over object, and you will see these points. Now you can adjust these points according to your object perspective. It will crop something like this. I'll show you the difference between these two. First simple crop tool. It will crop something like this. Now perspective crop. And it will crop according to the perspective. It will crop something like this. Now let's talk about our next slice tool. Now you can select multiple selections for crop. Let's select this toy cup and TV. It will not crop here. You have to save it in your computer. Press Ctrl, Shift, Alt and S. Select your folder. And select this all user slices. And save. Now go to your folder and you will see your selected slices here. And from here style. You can create perfect sizes of slice. Set your size here. Just drag and create. And from this option, you can set your size here. And simply click anywhere to make selection. And last tool is Slice Select tool. It helps in selecting the particular slice and change its position and scale its size. So this is it for today's video. You will find shortcuts used in this today's class in the description. We will see you guys in our next class.